Rock Hudson was Hollywood's ultimate leading man throughout the 1950s and 60s, romancing some of the industry's most beloved actresses on screen, such as Doris Day, Julie Andrews, and longtime friend Elizabeth Taylor. He was briefly married in order to mask his homosexuality. Hudson died of AIDS-related complications in 1985. His death caused a mini-panic in Hollywood, as one of his last roles, on the primetime soap Dynasty, required a long kiss with co-star Linda Evans Evans was, obviously, fine and not angry at Hudson for not disclosing his HIV status. Hudson was the first major Hollywood star to die of the illness. Amanda Blake was an American actress best known for her role as Miss Kitty on Gunsmoke. How she contracted HIV remains a mystery, but listed on her death certificate as a partial cause of death was CMV hepatitis, cytomegalovirus, an AIDS-related condition. Her fourth and last husband, Mark Speet, 1944-1985, also died of AIDS-related complications. Timothy Patrick Murphy, November 3, 1959 to December 6, 1988, was an American actor, perhaps best known for his role as Mickey Trotter on the popular CBS primetime soap opera Dallas from 1982-83. Murphy contracted HIV and died of AIDS on December 6, 1988 in Sherman Oaks, California, aged 29. He once stated that he had an affair with the allegedly bisexual actor Brad Davis, who had AIDS and committed assisted suicide in 1991. Robert Reed was best known for his portrayal of Mike Brady, the patriarch of the beloved 70s blended family and the Brady Bunch. Throughout his career, he received three Emmy Award nominations, for his work in Medical Center, Rich Man Poor Man, and Roots. Reed died in 1992 of bowel cancer but his doctor listed Reed's status as HIV positive on his death certificate. Dak Rambo on March 21, 1994, Dak Rambo, a famous American actor died of complications from AIDS at the age of 52. He stopped acting after revealing he'd tested positive for the AIDS virus.